so here we are going to discuss about the homogeneous and isotropic materials it is very important concept for solid mechanics as it is a common assumption in solid mechanics that material is homogeneous and isotropic and most of the formulas are applicable for such materials firstly to understand the difference between homogeneous and isotropic material we have two diagrams first diagram is for homogeneous material and second one is for isotropic materials in first diagram of homogeneous material we can observe that at two different locations one and two the property is not changing with respect to location however the property is different in different directions such a material is known as homogeneous in which there is a no change in property with location however it may change with respect to direction in second diagram for the isotropic material we can observe that at location 1 and 2 the properties are same in with respect to direction however it is changing with respect to location so such material is known as isotropic material whereas in homogeneous and isotropic material property does not change with respect to either direction or location if you found this video useful please do subs subscribe and like the channel